Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption 2 on the Mysterious JG. Not really sure why, but I created like a little uh, six hour roughly gap between videos, or yeah, five hour gap between videos. For no real reason, I just kind of like, you know, paused it. Oh, it's like, oh, I'm going to have to step away for a few minutes. Let me put the PS4 in rest mode. And boom, like five hours later, I'm like, oh yeah, for the last five hours, I've been waiting to come back and actually do this mission. It's fine. Uh, between videos, I watch something I haven't watched in a long ass time, which is uh, some Retsu praise. Uh, old, ch I think that channel's pretty much defunct now, but yeah, God hates Puccinas, folks. <laughs> just, just, you just need to know that God hates Puccinas. Alright. So anyway, let's rob us a, uh... Let's leave the horses off the road to the right here. Okay. That'll make the mission more challenging! Ah oh, shit! I don't got a, I don't got any kind of good weapons here. Uh, yeah, draw my rifle from the horse. No, actually, I do. I got a, I got a Lancaster repeater and the rolling block rifle. So if they. Uh, But I need something for my uh, dead eye core because my dead eye core is pretty crap right now. Something's gonna happen. Are you sure about that? As soon as they're close enough, we'll jump out, hit them fast. Just wait for my lead, okay? So something else is up. So, I kind of like made sure to shoot the coach driver immediately, but um, that didn't really work out too good. Because I jumped out from behind the rock. I guess I really need to stay back down in cover. I hope I just got the same gun. Yeah, because the whole thing was like a million dudes. Take up position behind these rocks. Good. The stage should be coming up the river. Well, do I still have a? Uh, yeah, because I ended up smoking the cigar. Jackson, any time now. I have some open miracle tonic, and I don't have my sniper rifle anymore. But there it is, and I don't see no escorts neither. <laughs> this should be a cakewalk. Are you sure about that? You see any? Oh. Is that close enough? People, uh... oh, you're s you're still kicking, huh? Oh, I thought you guys were both down. Go. 
got his hat right off. You laugh? Yeah. Are you? Evidently. That was not the way I was expecting things to go. I took, us into that a kinda trap. took it like that. I'm telling you, it was good information. Wait. There's Look. nothing in there. Look, there's some money here. Not much. Yeah, it ain't much. Because it was a trap. Stage companies do this all the time. They set up traps to, to catch fools. Oh, like you and me. <sighs> I feel like a fool. Well, that's well the is there any money on. then? He's still alive, so don't worry too much about it. It's all right. We got infinite continues. More turn up. All right. See you back at camp. By no means should we be escaping together. Well, man, I hope we made enough that it's profitable after I've paid my bounty for the ten billionth time. Don't uh, help me. Uh, Search the victims or anything. So I not shouldn't be complaining about that. You search the victims, then I uh, lose a portion of the take. But we do in fact have a uh, what is that? Uh, Fifteen dollar bounty. It's <laughs> pretty half-assed considering how many people we killed. And we'll certainly make that back, even just from, uh... like my uh, yep. bounty's gonna go up. I should have dealt with them a little faster than I did. Alright, well I, I just, by hanging out I made the bounty get worse, so shame on me. I thought I was gonna... I don't know how they reported me for murder. Or they should have just reported me for robbing uh, corpses. <laughs> how did that come to pass? Oh, they tripped over, tripped over the other horse. I'm sorry, friend. Sorry, my lovely horse. I kind of didn't pick up on the fact that I'm um, losing a lot of uh, Paragon points yep. from this, too. Didn't really realize that um, that corpse is going to be directly in our path as we went. Apparently, the horse fell over when I shot the rider. So the bounty went from 15 to 25. And probably I should have just not stayed to loot corpses. But I got some, I got like gold and platinum bands out of it. So it's entirely possible I will make out a profit in the end. I just need to actually find a fence. So $25 bounty across the entire state of Moine. Start slowly making back the uh, Paragon points I got for all those lost for all those murders. At the end of the day, we got just a little closer to Lenny, and that's our main objective. Hello, sirs. Hello, hey, friend. Man. Hello. Hello, mister. I hope this guy's Hello. not giving us bum, hey uh, Hello there. bum information, because um, we'll have to murder him. Welcome back. Oh, he's not, he's not the one. It's the one at the other window who, um, the one at the other window is apparently, it was a damn setup, Kenny. 
Yeah, the guy at the other window is the one who gives us uh, hot tips. So hopefully he's not betraying us. Oh, or no, it's the same guy, but he has to be at this window before he'll give us illegal uh, tips on uh, potential robberies. I think it's because I just paid off a bounty after murdering some guys. Excuse me, partner. Alright, so now if I knew where there was a fence, I could sell some stuff to the fence. I don't believe I can sell stuff to the general store. Where the hell is a fence? I mean, I know where there's one way up at Emerald Ranch. What the hell? I'm not really experiencing cash problems right now. I can, uh, I can carry these things around for a bit. It's not going to hurt anything. Is that the fur trapper or a fence? That is the trapper. Trapper John, MD. Alright, let's head back on over to Dutch, see if we can get distracted by any coach robberies on the way. Hey there. Well, hello. Mister. Just admiring your horse there. Anyway, just passing the time of day. Stop right where you are. Get a move on, will ya? You best finish your business in town and get Lamont Raiders on business. Oh. I was stopping because I thought they might have some kind of quest, but like Yeah, Lemoyne Raiders are just Really nothing was gonna happen there except I was going to end up killing them and probably getting a wanted level for it, so. It's been a long time since I fought gang members in town. I fought a... Uh, them, uh, whatever that is, the uh, Callahan, the, the, the gang with the Irish name. Yeah, I fought some of them in uh, Valentine, I guess, a long ass time ago. And it seems like if you kill them fast enough, you don't get in trouble for it if it's like apparent that they attacked you first. But like, yep. once other people start running around panicking and getting in the crass, uh, path, path of bullets, then, you know, it's real easy for you to end up getting in legal trouble. Hey there, Mr. Out of the way. Mister. Hey there, missus. Why, why is he being so mean to Sadie? She didn't do anything. Well, I got you close to uh, some place where I could tie you down. <laughs> Good enough, right? Well, I don't think the term is tie tie the horse down precisely, but. Uh, Oh, wait, now I got another icon that I don't recognize. Uh, I go hunting with Pearson. Oh, what the hell. Let's do all the fun little gang activities with the friends we can before... I mean... Nah, I gotta go crayfish hunting. No, I mean, really, unless something really... Dr the biggest possible surprise outcome of this game is that most of the characters in your gang don't die. I mean, we've pretty much been told to expect that everyone's going to die. And what I mean by that is... Um, common bull rush. I probably should be picking it, not eating it, but... But yeah, like yeah, considering where the next the, the this is a prequel to a game a game about 
the end of uh, this gang. Kind of not expecting many of the main story characters from our gang to survive. So let's put in a little time with all of them. Pearson, we had... Arthur seems to kind of mock Pearson for his weight. Fat shaming, Arthur. Shame on you. But, um... It doesn't seem like Pearson's a bad guy. From what interaction we have had with him. He's, he's looking for a compass, which I don't think we ever got him. Free as a bird now. Sure, old man. Nah, enough of that old man nonsense. I'm in the Call me fat mind. man or bald man. Oh, sorry. <laughs> How you getting now? Bored. You see that swamp, Arthur? That's God's own pantry. It's God's what pantry. Venison? Come on. Let's go gather some crawfish. See what else we can get. Crawfish? Yeah, crawfish. Finest eating there is. It's not just crawfish. No. There's monsters out there. Alligators, at least. Eat a feller for fun. Oh, Arthur. I thought you were a man. No, sir. No, I'm a, uh, I'm a Puccina lover. If you know what I mean. I am very much a coward. <laughs> but I guess I'll row. Head for those trees across from us and we'll take a look. On the starboard side. What? My left, your right. This is a boat, Arthur. Perform okay. much tighter turns than would actually be possible, Arthur. Okay. Aren't what they used to be. No, no, ground is too high here. Keep following the shoreline. What exactly are we looking for? We're looking for low ground and a lot of muck. You can't, you can't bitch that this game doesn't have enough content. That's for sure. Gotten a lot of videos out of this series so far. It's a much longer game than RDR one. I did not. This is the place. Oh. Now tell me, Arthur. Same. Have you ever birthed a cow? No. <laughs> it's nothing like that, but it's equally as gruesome if you're squeamish. Okay. You're really selling this, aren't you? You could have told me not to wear my fanciest clothes. <laughs> I love Arthur's hair as as you know the never Looks ever like cut your hair trend. thing Just that we've done. Stick your hand and watch. And there. <laughs> there you see. Good. Well, seems easy enough. Uh-huh. Let's go find another hole. So I'm always looking for holes. Are you in the Navy? Oh, years. Well, it must have been a year at least. Or close to that. Hmm. That's quite a range. All water under the bridge now. No pun intended. We were a very bridge-based navy. Oh, look there. Another crayfish hole. You see it? I do. It's an exciting mission. You try this time, Arthur. And remember to reach down deep and get right in there. They like to dig in a little blight. Alright, just tell me which button that involves. It's alright. They don't really bite. This is so stupid. Yeah, I mean, I got it. Oh, I got some. Oh, tetanus. As soon as you oh, nicely done, it. why don't you see if there's any more down there? Well, you didn't do that on yours. Oh, I guess I was supposed to hold. Oh, never mind. This is it. Collected two. All right. So they oh, they're bait animals. Meanwhile, we got various exciting dog portraits. You know the drill now. There yeah, it's really, it's a lot easier than doing submissions in a uh, WWE video game, but similar mechanic. Won't be much of a gumbo if we don't find some more. Well, I don't know. It could be like some shitty gumbo. We could just put a bunch of venison in the gumbo. Get down. Get down. Oh, I didn't even get to get down. It did it for me. There. Those gators. Yeah. Yeah. You can tell by the huge gator breasts. So, gator eggs. Gator eggs? Really oh. valuable. Even better eating. I love cooking with them. Okay. Tell you what. 
I'm gonna sneak over to the other side of them, draw their attention, and then run like hell. Now, assuming I don't get eaten, you go plunder the nest. Why don't we just kill the That's gators? Your plan? You're than I thought. Shh. I've done it before in Sumatra. It's easy. I've heard that line before. Oh, ye of little faith. Wait here, Mr. Morgan. We can enjoy the death of Pearson here. That's more of our tactical espionage action coming up. See where the gate is, uh, the eggs are now. All right, well, I'm in slow mo as long as this is activated. Made a lot easier by uh, the existence of Gator Egg Cam. Okay, that's all of them. So let's get back to the boat without getting killed by gators. The gators are coming back. They don't seem to have noticed me. And it looks like he's still alive. All right, sir, take us back to the dock. Move quickly now. That's what I call teamwork. I don't think I've ever seen gators are hunter killers. People pay a lot of money for those eggs. I'm told there's a collector in San Denis who gives top dollars for them. For military, of all things. Yeah, I've met him. He's quite the character. He's a weirdo. Well, this has been very pleasant. Very pleasant indeed. That was fun. Uh, I must get out more. Is that your idea of fun, is it? <laughs> oh, what? Thank you. Have some crawfish. And give me those gator eggs. Some of those eggs. Yeah, I was about to say, those are the valuables, right? <laughs> hey, maybe you could hatch that. Get yourself a new friend. There's a thought. A new reptilian best buddy. To replace Micah, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> well, did Micah leave at some point? I mean, I know he's one of the lizard people. That's what we've, That's where we're getting at here, right? You okay? I thought we were safe here. No, we... <sighs> Never make that mistake. There's gators everywhere. Alright, well, I should be getting on. Yes, yes. Inspect what? Inspect the litter. We got litters. We got lots and lots of litters. Micah. Thank you for your letter. I suppose I'm glad you ain't been hanged yet, but I'm going to have instance insist that if the fact that if I see you you won't be no time blah won't be no one needs to hang you as I will break your neck I ain't, ain't that I don't love you because I do what with you being my family and all we've done together but it's that I'm now a family man as you know I have daughters as you know I swore to the Lord Almighty that I would protect my daughters from all that is evil and wrong in this world if you would only help me repent of all that I have done when we were running together as you know and that means repenting of you as you know and washing my hands of you do not attempt to approach me do not attempt to visit me do not claim you know me if I hear you are within 50 miles of me, I will come out and find you, and then you'll meet your maker and apologize to him on our behalf for all the things we did. None of this should come to you as news. I was shocked to receive your letter. Do not write me again. Your brother, Amos Bell. Oh, that's, a, that's unfortunate. Looks like Micah's um, trying, maybe, to make things right with his family, and it's not going that way. Or perhaps he wrote to his brother... To try to get his brother's help in some nefarious scheme. I suppose we don't really know. But, um... 
we've right just about time to call it a video and we managed to complete a uh a side mission and uh oh we can go rustling with uncle uncle and arthur head to hill haven ranch to rustle some cattle to sell to click hive for cash well i have a feeling i know what we'll be doing in the next video because it seems like there's always something to be done other than going up and talking to dutch as he's requested As long as we can put off talking to Dutch as much as possible. I think we're just like kind of exhausting all of the missions that are supposed to populate for this camp. And I'm fine with that. I'd like to see as much of the content in this game as... Well, why is it spelled shite if he said shit? Well, we lost like two people. Uh, one of the, okay, so one of the two people we lost, we've only met during the course of the story. And the other one, Sean, the Irish bastard, we don't know how long he's been around. He would say shite. Women and children, too. This ain't <laughs> nothing nice. Wait, did a woman die that I didn't, that I'm forgetting about? Used to make some kind of sense, but now it feels like... Like some kind of Final Fantasy game. A miracle or waiting to die, and I can't tell which it is. Maybe your death will be miraculous. I mean, well, actually, we know how you're gonna die. Had problems, but never like this. This is just not that much fun anymore. And folks in Blackwater, they was real mad, and we responded. Uh huh. With vicious murder. Like animals. Like cornered animals. Which is literally sudden, what you were. Things don't make much sense no more. We have become what we set out to hate. Well, you set out to hate something? It was your objective? It does. Oh, well. Anyway, I sure hope things are nicer after the fall of our gang. I can imagine that if this gang were ever to disband, my life would be nothing but gravy. All right, folks, uh... We're going to call it a video here. When we come back next time, it uh, looks like I'm going to be doing some wrestling with Uncle. And I can't help but suspect that even though in this mission, Pearson actually uh, pretty useful. Um, I have a feeling, just because it is basically his only character, Uncle will not be useful. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.